Hunters, this is Kimchi. And Tofu. Yeah. yeah. Hunter Hunter episode number 112 and 113. Yeah. 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 Can we finally say yeah? Oh, Zoldik. And Netro. Oh, hold on. We got to do We got to do it. <laughs> what are you doing with your hair? This is supposed to follow all the way up. Because there's like a bunch. So I'm like trying to go. <laughs> Dude, that's why you're shaking it. Yeah, I'm compensating. You try it. Oh. No, he doesn't do that. Oh, he slaps. He does a he, big slap. He goes slap. like this. And then he brings it down. And then does the slap. Booty Boot. slap. No, no booty slap. All right, I'm going to do 10,000 punches in a day today. The challenge. You're going to do it? Yeah, 24-hour punch challenge. Dude, you should do that. You I won't even do... last for an hour. <laughs> this, but I mean, like on YouTube, you should just do a live stream 10,000 punch challenge. <laughs> 10,000 punch challenge? You want to see how far we do it? Yeah. How long we do it? I, I dare you to oh, do it. Oh man, I don't think both of us do it. No. What do you mean no? Both of us got to do it. My legs is already shaking from that. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh, 24 hour stream, 10,000 punch. All oh right, we'll die. God. We so should do it. We'll probably look like Netero by the end of it. <laughs> We have to divide the amount of time it takes to do 10,000 within 24 hours. Man, that's impossible. That's impossible, babe. Nah, <laughs> we'll die. But guys, thank you guys for joining us. 112, 113, it's going down! Yeah! Woo! I'm so excited for this. I know you guys are too. Thank you guys for joining Kimchi and Tofu. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, let's do it. Let's go and start the show! Yeah! Oh, 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 oh. Time for that eye contact. Uh, yeah, but they're gonna cut it right when they see it. They're gonna we're gonna go straight into the intro. Yeah. Aya, see, I told you. Aya. Uh. Ah. Yes, yes, it's starting. It's the slow mo. I, I knew it. it. What's his reaction? Oh. oh, they didn't even know that UP would be here. Yeah, so they didn't even expect this. Man, thank God uh, Killua and uh, Shoot, because Killua's more calm now, too. Yeah. If it was last time, he would have been like, oh, shoot, this is bad. And ran. Here comes his wings. Oh. No. Yes. Wait, you no. sure that's wings? That looks like thorns to me. Yeah. An extra hand? Wait, how many arms does this guy have? Oh, six. Whoa. Whoa. He's like a spider. So this guy's the shield hero. Oh, so that's why he has no human in him. Oh. That's why the other two are more human, has more human traits than this guy does. Yeah. Shoot, froze! Oh, no, please don't. Oh, he's keeping his distance from him. Oh, so he's trying to let shoot go. Knuc knuckles. Knuckles. Go. What, what? And then what happened? Oh, oh! the raining arrows! Oh, so they're actually doing damage. Yeah, it, yeah. Dragon drive, dive. So he knows yes, his, his grandpa's yes, here. Yes, yes, the old man's friend is your grandpa. He knows his grandpa's here. <laughs> yes. They're all froze. Who, Gon and... Yeah, think? Gon's not even faced by this. He's like, dude, they're focused. Oh my God, <laughs> look at Gon, he's focused. Yeah, Gon is going for Yubi. This is not good. Well, what is he doing? It's because Knuckles has to go. No matter what happens, they have to go with the plan. Yes. No, how did he realize that? Realize what? <gasps> oh, no. Oh. oh! Oh, if they die <gasps> while invisible, then they can't find him. They don't even, so... He was not even sure if he's alive, if he got hit yes. by it, because he's invisible. And so that means it's up to going to deal with him. Oh, shoot. Wow, oh, no. look at those kids, man. They're just going. Oh my God. <gasps> oh Is he no, going crazy? don't tell me he's getting broken. Oh no, oh. He, he, he's impressed by going, right? Yes, reacting faster than he did. So this is why shoots like this. Yes. <gasps> oh wait, he's oh, broke, his, he cage. broke his cage. He's not scared Go! anymore. Hey, nice. 
Oh, Morel oh. sees it. Good, good, good. Subarashi. Oh my god, Yuffie looks scary god, now. God, look at Gon's eyes. Yeah, Gon's eyes changed. Oh, wait, did he find Knuckles? Please, no. Oh, the punch. Yeah, Knuckles. Yeah. yeah Knuckles is alive. Yes. <laughs> Plan has gone good. Oh, they're alive. Yeah. We got this. Oh, they're going for it. Go, go, go. Oh. <laughs> this so guy's not... so confused. <laughs> good. Yes. Yes. They're pure. Yes. <laughs> Perfect. Just what they needed. Bankruptcy activated. Hell yeah. Oh, and you can't see APR either. Oh. Oh, whoa, whoa, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. It's looking like an alien. What the heck? Holy oh. cow. So that was, that was not Pito's name? The one that's coming out of the, the stairway. No, that was, but Pito, now, right now, this is his. A monster yeah. with an immense amount of aura. So he has a lot of aura too. <sighs> ten more than ten times than Morel? What? Wow. Oh yeah, because this is uh Knuckles' first time experiencing the aura from any of the guards. Yup. Oh yeah, so APR's gonna take APR... forever. Dude, it's gonna take a whole day or something. Yeah. This looks like Pito's the one that's making it rain. Yeah. Oh Whoa. no. Whoa. Now they're feeling Pito's aura. Okay, yeah, yep, that is Pito's aura. Oh gosh, it's game on now. Wow. Poof is fast. Wow, look at Poof. Is he protecting Komugi? Oh yeah, where did they go? Oh shoot, yeah. Ah, so Pito doesn't have wings, so she has to wait till she gets on the ground. Oh no, she can trace them, right? Yeah. Where is the king? Yeah. Oh my god! Oh. He's protecting Komugi! Komugi is down though! Zordic! Oh, Zordic. Zordic is going on his. Is on, oh, both, no, of, both them. of them! Oh shoot. So this is bad news for us. Good news for the guards. But she can't do anything because she's falling. No way, she's gonna actually launch from here? Oh yeah, she's, from the ground. Yeah, so she can get there faster. Ooh. ooh, ooh. Oh my god, oh. look at the speed. Look at this freaking speed. Is this the king's aura? Whoa. The king's aura. Because of Komugi. Komugi. Do you think Komugi died? I don't know, but... <gasps> That's not Komugi's oh. blood, is it? Yeah, it is. Hers is red. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, oh my oh, gosh. No. Oh, this is going to make the king really bad. <gasps> oh, yeah, she's... no, 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 oh, no. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is really bad. Yeah, look at his face. Oh, my God. Dude, there's so many things going on right now. Oh, my God. And they oh, made it. No. Dude, the king is gonna go on a rampage. Oh shoot! Wow. Okay, I'm scared. I'm 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 scared. Yeah. Oh. Oh. They're giving king the time, right? Yes. Oh no, Pito! She's gonna go directly to work on her. I think. No, I think he wants Pito to save her. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. That's right. That's right. Wow, what a situation. Whoa. You see, she's crying. Is that the first favor? Or not favor, but... I don't know. Wow. Even Netero's like, just hold it. Let's, you know... Yeah. Respect. Yeah, respect. Because he's being humane. Ah, <sighs> oh, even he's saying that this wasn't part of the job. Yeah. To get some innocent girl killed. Well, they weren't expecting this from the king. Oh, yeah, because they'll be separating him. Well, oh, are... here comes the bad aura. 
<gasps> Did they not see him? Oh! Wow! Oh my God! We're in big oh, trouble! Shoot! We're in big trouble! <laughs> what? I'm the like, king walked by them. Yeah, but was I'm like I'm kind of confused because was it because of Pito's Nen that they got distracted, or is just because like just all the events that played, or just that's how powerful the king is? Like, there's all these scenarios on why this just happened, and I'm like confused on which one it is. I think it's everything at once. Probably there's some so many things are going in his head. Look at one thing too. Could Netero and Zoldic? Kill off the king right there at the moment. Because he's it, trying to save the woman. If they didn't have respect or the inhumane thing didn't yes. fall into place, right? And they were just there for the moment for the assassin. We're here to take care of the king no matter what. And then while the king's in that moment, you think Netero should have with Zoldi, she like just attack right there and just be done with it. The reason why that they stopped is because they thought that the king was a threat to humanity. They thought that there is no heart in him. There's no way that he can change like Colt is able to change. Right. So that's why they're going to take him down because he was a huge threat. But now they're seeing that he does have compassion. He has love for a human. Oh. So that's why it kind of changes things. And the, that's why they have respect for him because he has love for this woman that just got like is nearly human. killed. Yeah, a that's human. human. Yeah. And they're just seeing love from him rather than just hatred and like take over the world and power. That's right. So that's why they're they're like they're having doubts and hesitating now. Yes, but then when Pito activated her nan again, they're just like, oh, sh you know, it's back to this. But then the king just walks past him. So I'm like, is it the play of both moments, or is it just Pito's nan because hers is like deadly, like strong, scary aura, or is it just both in general? I. I'm, kind I'm of confused like, with whoa. that too. If it was just the king would just walk super fast, yeah, or were they frozen? The king is surpassing Netro's <laughs> level of a thousand punches in a minute. You know how he can yeah. move so fast. It's like is the king fast on a way up here? Oh, there's so many things happen in this episode. I mean, I mean, if you want to go all the way back into okay with the gun, yes, the problem with the invisibility was that. If the arrow actually did hit Knuckles yes. and Melodon, that means that they don't know if he does die. They won't be able to find him. Yeah, they won't be able to find him because of Melo, the um, God's ability, whatever. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, God's ability. But the fact that Gorn was still focused, it didn't even phase him. He was on top of everything. He realized that. I wonder, Gon saw that with the king and Komugi. Do oh. you think Gon would have just still been on focus and just went? I think he would have stopped in his tracks. He too. would have stopped, right? Yes, but then seeing Pito, I think he would have been enraged by Pito. Like, oh, uh, there's so many things. Yeah, that, yeah, all of this is just like, whoa, oh my gosh. Oh, I wow. wasn't expecting uh, Komugi to get hurt from those arrows. I didn't know that those arrows were going to actually cause damage. I thought it was more of like a distraction. <sighs> okay, and Komugi, she's dead. She yeah. died. She did die. I oh. I don't know. She. I they she said that die. there's like immense amount of blood. So she's probably like on death's bed. She's either dying or dead. Yes. And the fact that Netero was just like, no. Right. And why is Pito crying? That's the thing I didn't understand why Pito was crying. Like, is she crying for remorse for the king? Is she crying because she's angry about what's going on with the king wanting to save the woman uh, Komugi's life? Is she... Is she scared for her own life that if she doesn't bring Komugi back that she's gonna die? No, what, I don't think it? it's any of that on her own thing. I don't. I I honestly don't think because at first I thought the king was gonna be mad at Pito mm -hmm. because he specifically told Pito to protect Komugi, right? Yes. And you know how when the moment when Pito saw uh, Netero, mm -hmm. she should have came back and be on defense mode, but instead she acted on her own because she was so excited. Yes. So she left. Yes. And that's I thought that's what got Komugi killed. And that's why I thought the king was pissed off about that. Saying oh. that you were supposed to protect Komugi. Mm -hmm. And she just left the palace to fight them. And also, I think the reason why Pito cried was that when king looked at her and he, it was in his eyes, he, he was asking Pito, like, please, please help her. So was it out of, com like, she's crying for seeing the compassion from the king? I think that's what it is. Like, she's tearing because it's it's, it's just they don't understand what love is, I, I don't think. Oh, 
I, right? Yeah, I, I'm I think not it has sure. something to do with that or something. But um, that. Yeah, I, when the Are, king looked, because she started tearing when the king looked at her and was like, "Please save her." But you remember how Poof was crying because he was scared that the king was gonna have a heart because he wants to see the king as the strong, powerful. I can conquer anybody. I can kill anyone. Do you think Pito's crying because she feels the same way as Poof and oh, seeing that, that from the that, king, the weakness in the king? The king has a heart. That the king has a weakness. I don't think it would be a weakness because I wouldn't say love is a weakness. To I them, think love is a strength. But to them, they see it as a weakness of something. Because they don't understand it. Ye yeah. Yeah. Because I think love is a strength. But it's a weakness at the same time because somebody can turn that against you. That's true. That's true. So that's why I'm saying it's a weakness. Yeah. Love is a weakness and a strength. Yes. Because strength is love as in when you fight for someone you love, you mm -hmm. become stronger. Yeah, when you fight for somebody you love, you become stronger. But when somebody uses that against you, you can become weak. That's true. That person makes that's, you weak. And that's what Gon, right? Yes. That's the problem with Gon. That, yes. that could be his weakness. Yes. That's true. Uh, wow. uh, okay. God. So many, so many things happening. Oh, well, man. thank God Knuckles is alive, but scary because it seems like they're going to have to take a long time for... Um, the APR, APR, seven hundred thousand. So yes. APR. I mean, we're we're talking about he has to be survived for a whole freaking for a day. Long time. Either that or Meleoro has to hold his breath longer. Right. And oh. now, and now he's evolved. He's got all these eyes on him, all these hands. He looks like an alien. Yeah, because he has no human trait. Yeah, what they say is he's only made out of magic beasts. Yeah, magic beasts. Yeah, magic beasts. So no human. That's why I always thought that why does this guy seem so off? Between these other two. Yeah. You know? Because I at least shall not it's not too off. I think maybe he still does have a little bit of human because he has a human face, but he can change That's into true. other stuff. So he was just made purely from ma uh, magic Magical beasts. beasts. Magical yeah. beasts. All right, let's get on to the next one. Yep. Also, one thing that was I, I thought that was very fascinating, the whole thing that's been happening was like point one second. Yeah. Because if you can tell on the background when the lights drop, they're at the same position. But, I mean, you can see it slowly go down, but they're oh. at the same position. So that means that that's the speed that all these guys are going. They're showing it in slow, kind of like slow-mo. It's like slow motion. But in real time. Yeah. So it's like, no, we're seeing in their point of view because they yes. see it as slow motion. Yeah. Because they're thinking everything in their head like, oh, this is wrong. Like, they're yeah. all thinking that same thing. That's exactly what I mean. But on the background, when you see the lights falling, it's falling really slow. Right? So it's like everything's going by like so quick in a blink of an eye. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's amazing. Wow, this castle, this palace is in ruins. Oh, wait, what's going on? Is that Yupi? Yeah, that's Yupi. Oh, now he's like looking... Really alien! Octopus. Like octopus. <gasps> oh, oh, no! Sh oh, oh, his leg! Oh, yeah, his leg is broke. He can't move. <gasps> yeah, that's uh, that's gone. It's gone. The rest is up to you. Oh, he was saying it to Knuckles, but oh, so he didn't want to give Knuckles away. Oh, I see. So he wasn't saying it to shoot. Oh my God! What Here is this go. music coming out for Morel? Oh <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> shoot! This is a badass soundtrack for him. Yeah. Oh, he's already read through it. Oh, wait, 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 but he's making him use his Nen, right? Oh, here's yes, the home blow. run, home run. But he has eyes on the back of him, yeah. Oh, oh wait, oh, he, he protected can himself. take out arms whenever he wants. Oh, <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh that's the smoke. Oh, oh my gosh, you shit. scared me too. Oh, God. Look at him sweating. Oh, <laughs> Oh, Freak, you scared me. <laughs> yeah. God, dude, I got scared. There we go. Yeah, but where's the APR at? What's the number on it? Bankruptcy? 590. Oh, that's not much at all. Oh, no. Is he figuring him out? Okay, so he still thinks that that's a um, He morale. still can't see. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Oh, oh, it's shoot time. This ultimate oh. technique. 
So it's like he can fly. He's standing on his arm. Yeah. yeah. Whoa! So he just covered it just cause? Just cause. He's feeling pretty confident. <laughs> wow, look at shoot, he looks so cool! Yeah. Flying fish. Come on, what is he gonna do? So oh. this is just a distraction? He's able to land hints on him. Oh, that's him even going yes. around. Oh, that's so fast. Which is giving Morel time to get the pipe, yeah. Oh, for him to get it for him. Yeah, so he distracted him so he can get his pipe back to him. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> drink ourselves silly with good alcohol. I'll join you. I will join you. <laughs> Morel is so proud of them. So proud of his students. And you can't give him a hug because he's too manly, so he has to get alcohol. Ah, so they went, they changed direction and they were left. Okay, go on and kill her. Go, you can't mm. go. Go. Oh, granted him the use of multiple set of eyes. Ah, so oh. that's why he was able to dodge the dragon dive. Ah, dude. Oh, two command noobs. ants. Two soldier ants. Oh, he's, he needs to help Ikargo. Wow. Oh, they're separating. They're separating. I think Go knows. That's why he didn't look back. I think he yeah. knows. Like, go ahead, Kiloa. Oh, man. Hold on. But if they separate here... <sighs> He's gonna protect you, Ikarigo. Yeah, this is not like him. Yes, He's the one that's, that's right. the other way. That's right. Kilo was becoming like Gohan. No, don't freeze though. Don't freeze. Keep going. Whoa, look at his eyes. Oh. <laughs> yeah, these guys should be easy though. Yes. So fast. One other. Oh, who's that other guy? The wolf? Oh, the wolf. Yeah. Who's he going to be tracking? Can he even hear Kilo's footsteps? I don't know, but he can smell. Oh, sh oh yeah, because it might f mess up Flutter. Oh, is he not happy? No, no, it's just, th this is no time to even do small talks. <gasps> oh! Ikargo's words woke him up, so he was feeling regret that he did this, but yes. Ikargo was like, dude, I owe you. That's the insect that's indebted. <sighs> yes, now Kilo was ready to move on. He's, he feels good about it. Okay, good. Let's go. See, this is not good, though, for Flutter. Oh, wait. Who's coming here? Is this a trap? <gasps> is that Chidu? Oh, oh no. no. Oh, and the blue lobster, lobster. of course. Ah, oh, freaks. Three on one. Oh, this no, is not No, but they good. don't know. They don't know that Flutter is infested. But Wolf does. Oh, no. Ah, oh, stupid Wolf. Damn, he figured it out. Please don't kill a cargo. <laughs> no, he's, no, no, no. Don't tell me he's caught. Oh, yeah. These guys don't even know Leo's dead. This guy really believes the king's dead? Whoa, what is that? Is he going to kill himself? Wow, what is he doing? He's lost it. Yes. He's completely lost it. Oh, wait. You don't want him spending time with that woman? So is he going to go try to kill Komugi? Wait, he's... Hold on. So he already figured out what happened to the king. Oh, he's because he knew the king was there and he didn't go. Ah, that's why he's like, I don't belong as a royal guard. Holy cow. <gasps> oh, oh, Morel. Oh, <laughs> yo. Oh. 
Man, Morales just gonna 1v1 him? Sp- spiritual message. Oh, the moth skills to make oh. him a zombie, right? Hallucinate him. Or hypnotize. Hypnotize. Yeah, hypnotize. Yeah. Where's Killua? He should be catching up at this point. Oh, he There's sees the, the king. king. Oh my god, look at his eyes. And Nethro and Zoldic. Yeah. Oh, mm, wow. his face. Oh, he's giving the sign. Pito's in there. Ah. He's giving him the sign. Look at his aura. Oh, <laughs> he's flaming. Oh my god. Yeah. He's ready to fight. Oh my god, but how is he gonna handle this? This is so fun. <laughs> this yeah. is so fun. You wanna go to the next episode? Oh ah, my god. Hunter Hunter so fun. Yeah. It's so fun. I I cannot express how much I'm enjoying this so much. As much as it's so stressful, <laughs> as much as you know, it's such an emotional coaster ride. It's so fun. It really is. This is so fun. I, I can't believe this. This is so fun. It's <sighs> okay, so. Even this episode, there's so many things going on. First of all, Killua. Killua saves Ikargo, and now Ikargo is indebted to him. You remember? Killua told Ikargo, do not tell me thank you next time because we're friends. So right. that's why Ikargo says, I owe you instead because it's like, I, you know, that's exactly. the Exactly, right. So that's why it's indebted. And the thing is, like, Killua was in so much regret. He was like, why the hell am I doing this? I literally just told Gon not to do this kind of stuff, you know? Yes. And it's like, he just literally met Ikargo. And Here the thing he is, is doing it for him. For him. I'm like, did, did this guy just make a new best friend? I'm he like, Gon. <laughs> Gon's right there. It's like... But his plan of helping Ikargo is backfiring. Backfiring? What do you mean backfiring? Because Flutter's oh. been exposed. He's got a, Yeah, he got exposed. That's right. That's true. What do we do for Ikargo? Rest in peace? No, I don't think it's rest in peace for his cargo. I hope not. Oh, yeah, because there's no one else to save him. No. From here on out, every man to himself. Yes. So unless he can play it off real cool, then we're safe. If not, we're screwed. So we just cargo screwed. So right now we have to believe in his acting ability. Yes. (laughs) Oh, my God. I think cargo would be good at that. I hope so. Right. I'm really worried for him. I thought that... When um, Ikargo and Kilo was passing by and they're not saying a word, I was like, oh, shoot, don't tell me freaking Ikargo is going to die. Because I'm like, you know, that foreshadowing. Yeah. But then it was for that moment to, for him to say, I owe you. Because I'm like, dude, at this point right now, everything is moving so fast and we're seeing everything in slow motion. But there's no time for small talks or anything like no. that. It's just zoom, zoom, One, two, zoom. three. Yeah. Gon's not even... Gon was running. And even if he did see Killua, there's no time for talk. No. He's just like... You just have to go. Straight. When you look straight. And then Killua, he didn't have the time to even tell Gon. was like, I gotta go. And this is bad too because now Killua is behind Gon. Gon is already finding out that Pito is in the other room. Pito's in the room with K- Komugi. Oh, so you think Gon, Gon would just go without waiting for Killua? Probably he'll Shoot, go because in there. The way Gon looked... Yeah, he, he's raging. That's not the Gon I know. No. That's not freaking Gon from Greed Island. But is he going to be able to keep that when he sees Komogi being fixed? I think right now, Gon, I think he's okay. Or maybe, oh, here's another thing. How about this? Maybe he thinks that uh, Pito's doing the same thing that she did to Kite to Komogi. So then that makes him enraged even more. Gon... Because he doesn't know the whole thing that just happened. Right now, what I feel for Gon yeah. is that I feel that he's very collected. He's he's playing this everything right by the books. Yes. He knows that he shouldn't put emotions on this if he wants to complete this mission. Right. So you believe that he's going to be fine? No, that's the thing. I that's what that's the thing I'm scared of is because he looks too collected right now. Oh, that's okay. the thing I'm worried about because right now. Gon is not... I, I I just don't know what's going on inside his head. Yeah. It's not him right now. No. I feel like he's re- literally running in super thin ice. R- super thin ice before he actually blows up or something, right? You know in the moment when you feel a certain emotion, when you're angry or frustrated or something, right? Yeah. And you just don't want to think about it and you're just like keep going and say, okay, I got to finish work today. I got to do this, right? Yeah. But then when once something snaps, you, that person just... He just snaps. Yeah. 
th that's what I'm scared of of gone. It's this feeling of when you're trying to hold something in uh -huh. and you're just like, okay, I got to make sure I cannot snap. I cannot do this. I cannot do this. But then, uh, I don't know how to say it I don't know. He's been waiting for this moment. So I feel like he's going to, he's going to go in there. He's too focused the, into Pepito. Yes, that he's going to be, that Komugi's going to throw him off when he gets in there, right? Komugi? Oh yeah, Komugi would throw him off. But then at the same time, they're saying that he's in his zone because he already assumed what was going to happen with shoot, um, Knuckles. So I, I, I don't know. Uh, Is he going to be able to read the situation right when he enters that room? That's what I'm wondering. That's true. Because Gong can just come out, just blow up mm -hmm. Rage and just act on his own mm -hmm. without Killua. Yes. I'm scared for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you scared? Uh, I'm a little <laughs> bit nervous for Morale. I, I don't know how he's going to um, protect himself. From I think he'll be okay. Poof. Do you, what do you think? He'll use another smoke, blow it away, <laughs> blow it right back at him, backfire it? I think Morel will be okay just because I believe that Morel knows what to do in situations. He's very smart. True. Um, you know, we don't. I don't really judge Morel by his strength. I judge Morel. I, I see Morel as just, you know, strategist. Yes. So I'm sure whether if he does put himself in a situation where he's on the losing side, I'm for sure he'll figure out a way to get out. Yeah. Yeah. So I think Morel is very smart. So I'm not too worried about Morel. Now, on the other hand, Knuckles and Shoot. Yeah, going against uh, Yupi. Have you, like, grown into Knuckles and Shoot? Because now when I see Knuckles and Shoot, I love these guys. Yeah. From the beginning when we saw them, I was like, who are these guys, you know? Yeah. But now it's like, I feel I feel these guys so much. I've grown into Knuckles and Shoot yeah. just as much as like Gon and Killua. Like. Yeah, I want to say I've grown into them as much as Gon and Killua. But yeah, I've, they've grown on me. No, I, what I mean, like grown into them is like Knuckles. I mean, Gon and Killua's relationship is the same as Knuckles and oh, shoot. Shoot's relationship. Yes. You know? They're, yeah. It's just them older. Uh, also, with Poof scene where he was, you know, talking to himself and that whole scene, that was actually a pretty cool scene with uh, Poof. But I think the whole thing was that he finds him, he looks at himself as a traitor because he knew exactly where the king was, but he believed that the king was not like that. So he went to his throne room. Even if he knew that he was out there to save Komugi. He feels like a traitor because the he went to the king's room hoping that the king wouldn't um, be with Komugi. No, he already he knew. knew. He, he knew. already knew that the king would be with Komugi. But he went to the throne room anyway. Be because he believes himself. Because he believes that he is an absolute king. Yeah. And what he's saying is that he, sh that he wasn't open-minded of... Uh, the king being open-minded or something, but yeah. he was keep telling himself that this is an absolute king. He won't do that. But inside, deep down inside, he knew that the king was with Komugi and he's, yet he still went to the throne room. Yes. Um, so he's beating himself up for it, saying that he's not worthy of being a royal guard. Because if you're a royal guard, what is the meaning of being a royal guard? Is there being royal guard being just a security and just protecting king or actually understand everything uh inside and out of the king to really protect him that's true yeah you're right on that one yeah yeah, yeah to protect him and he didn't want to protect the girl he wants the girl to die yeah so i think that's where he sees his failure as a royal guard because he's like what is my job or what is the absolute king yeah. Is my job just to protect the king or is my job also as well to understand the king and uh, protect what he loves as well? You know, not just him as a physical king. Yes. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. All right, guys. That was uh, Hunter Hunter episode 112 and 113. A lot of things happened to today's episode, but man, this show is freaking fun, guys. Yeah. So, guys, thank you, guys. We'll see you soon for 114 and 115. Till then, have a great, great day. And we'll see you next time. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.